Hey guys, welcome to the show today. On today's show, we're talking about a game changer in the industry, and that is the new Ronin from Prime Archery. Let's get into it. But before we do that today, I want to say a special thanks to our good friends at Easton, Trophy Ridge, Scott Archery, and Gas Bowstrings for their help and support in keeping this channel going. And now, on to the show. So as many of you know, a lot of talk has been going on around the idea of things are getting too expensive in the archery industry. Well, I'm here to tell you today that that is actually false. Uh, companies are actually producing really high-end bows that are uh, at a price point that you could probably afford compared to some of the top tier ones that we've seen. Prime being one of those, creating the Ronin. This bow hits amazing specs and amazing technology at a very low price. This bow you can get right now for $850. That is a steal for a bow that with this type of technology that's on it. So when we say that bows are overpriced today, I would suggest that's not an accurate statement anymore. The Ronin breaks that, and there's a couple other companies who are breaking that too as we speak. But this bow from Prime right here is stacked with great technology. Let's talk about the specs and the tech real quick and then we'll shoot the bow. So the Ronin features axle axle of 34 inches, the brace height is six and a quarter inches, IBO speeds of up to 342 feet per second, mass weight is 4.5 pounds, draw weights are 50, 60, 70 pounds in 10 pound increments. Uh, draw lengths can go 26 to 30 and a half and it's a left or right handed availability. They do have some solid colors, morel black and recon gray and a whole bunch of camo patterns like King's XK7, Realtree Edge, Opni Fade Subalpine. Uh, definitely some extra option there as well. But some of the cool features of this bow that are very important to note is they share a lot of the same great aspects with the RevX bows, uh, including the core cam. You're getting the core cam, you're getting the nano grip, you're also getting the quick tune technology with this bow. Center grip riser on this bow, you're still getting that amazing center grip technology from Prime, uh, which is an amazing thing if you haven't shot it. You can definitely tell the difference and feel it when you shoot their bows. It's one of my favorite things about Prime. Let's talk about what you don't get on this bow. You don't get the IMS system for your rest, but if you don't care, if you're just gonna screw it in anyway, it doesn't really matter. You're not getting the Picatinny front for your sight, but again, does it really matter if you don't care if you just get a regular sight with two bolts on the side? So I just say these things because it's important because you can make an affordable bow with a high-end bow right in front of you here. The bow also has the Flexus here, so you're still getting that same technology as you would on a RevX. So these are great aspects, guys. Uh, all I can tell you is let's go ahead and shoot the bow. I haven't shot it, but I can tell you right now, I know because I've shot primes for a while, this is gonna be a great shooting bow, especially $850. Uh, think about that price point at this being a 34 inch axle axle and the things you can do with this bow at that price. A 34 inch axle axle is going to be a very forgiving bow and allows you to do whether it's target archery, 3D archery or hunting all in one for 850 bucks. That's a really good deal guys. Prime Ronin 2970, 350 grains. 319 feet per second, 450 grains, 284 feet per second, 550 grains, 259 feet per second, 650 grains, 240 feet per second. Whew. 100 hit my arrow. Just real quick guys, here are the clips. These little clips right here will go into uh, what they would call more of a fast paced tuning capability of the Prime Bose, the core cam. These right here slide into the bow and these spots right here, as you can see, those ones come out and you can change it. They have marks on the side of them so you know which is which and you can change it which will push your cam left to right however you need it to get it in tune. Very cool, very simple and pro shops do like this process. So in your prime bag, you get those clips for the quick tuning, but you also get this little clip that goes on for limb driven systems like the ham ski, like vapor trail. Uh, anybody who has a limb driven system, this piece right here will snap onto the end right over this nut right here. It snaps in and it looks like this. And then right there, you could put that's on there and then what that does is has a groove 
that you can then use to loop your limb driven system from. So pretty cool, very effective, and it's perfect that they have a place for that on this cam system and this bow. So whatever your thoughts are this year about getting a new bow, this Prime Ronin is a huge deal in the marketplace. Uh, this bow shot great, it has a great draw cycle, great back wall, center shot technology, nano grip. I mean, you really get a great feel for this bow. And at the price this bow is, it is really hard to beat. You are getting some of the same technologies as you would on the premier bow just minus some small things but in that case you're saving a ton of money and it gives you a lot of options to get into it so no longer can people say that they can't afford a new bow because this price is just right there's a lot of advantages to this bow and i'm very proud and happy what g5 prime was able to do with this ronin at the price so guys i'm not sure what's left to say about this bow this ronin is lights out and i'm not just saying that i'm telling you 850 bucks. This is probably one of the best deals I've seen in the industry. Getting some of that amazing technology from Prime. It really puts everything into perspective about people not being able to get a quality bow that they want. Now they can get it and get it at a great price and use the rest of that money towards the accessories they might need to outfit that bow. I'm Dave Thomas. Thanks for watching Boner Plan. If you got anything out of this video today, please subscribe and hit that like button and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything else. Special thanks to all the sponsors who make this show possible. And also a shout out to all the great people out there doing great things in archery, getting kids involved every day. We'll see you next time right here on Bowhunter Planet.